Welcome to History Students Watching. We're going to begin by reviewing our states across the United States, all 50 of them. We're going to have a competition between the girls and boys team to see how many each team can remember. Students watching, you see if you can beat these contestants. First girl and boy, and ready to name that state. Washington. Girls, next two. Wyoming. Students watching, anyone? Yuna? Montana. Jackson. Oregon. Oregon, boys have it next to you. So, Lexi and Jacob. Alaska. Tie both teams a point. California. Boys, we're a hair faster next to you. Nevada. Tie both teams a point next to you. Jackson and Madison. Wyoming. Students watching? Anyone? Jimmy? Idaho. Boys, next to you. Jimmy, Anna. Wyoming. Montana. Montana girls have it. Asa and Yuna. Wyoming. Yes, this is Wyoming. Boys have it next to Arthur and Tyra. Utah. Utah boys next to. Starts with a C. California. No, students watching. Anyone? Dev? Colorado. Boys next to Emily Aiden. Nevada, Arizona. Arizona, no points for the second answer, but it is Arizona next to? New Mexico. Boys, next to? Texas. Tied both teams a point. Oklahoma. Girls wear hair faster. Kansas. Girls, next to? Jackson and Madison. Nebraska. Girls, next to? Jimmy, Anna. Tie both teams a point. Minnesota. Let's try Asa and Yuna again. Iowa. Iowa is right. Arthur and Tyra. Illinois. Students watching? Anyone? Morgan. Missouri. Missouri girls have it next to? Students watching? Anyone? Asa? Missouri. It is Missouri again. Right. A second point for the boys, or a boys point that time next to Emily and Aiden. Arkansas. Arkansas girls have it next to Amaya and Presley. Louisiana. Tie both teams a point. Hawaii. Boys wear hair faster. Maine. Tie both teams a point. Dev and Morgan. Florida. Tie both teams a point. Jackson and Madison. Indiana. Boys, next to Jimmy, Anna. Illinois. Tie both teams a point. Asa and Yuna. Michigan. Girls, next to Arthur and Tyra. Iowa. Students watching? Anyone? Jackson? Ohio. Ohio is right. Boys have it next to? <laughs> Students watching? Anyone? Dev. Pennsylvania. Pennsylvania. Boys have it next to Emily Aiden. Vermont. Tybo teams a point. Amaya Presley. Blue one. New, New Jersey girls have it next to Lexi and Jacob. Arkansas. Kentucky is right. Boys have it next to Virginia. Virginia boys next to Georgia. Tie both teams a point. Jackson and Madison. South Carolina. Students watching. North Carolina. It is North Carolina. Just in time. Boys have it. Next to Jimmy and Anna. Purple one. Maryland. Tie or girls wear hair faster. Girls get that point. Asa and Yuna. Purple one. Connecticut. Girls next to Arthur and Tyra. West Virginia. Boys next to? New York. And girls have it. Last one was the, right there. So let's take a look at our score. Looks like we have 5, 10, 15, 23 for the girls. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 6, 26 for the boys. So boys won by three. Close competition. Boys, give yourself a pat on the back. Girls, you may come line up. 
and then boys, you may come line up in your places as well. Our scorekeepers were coming as well. We're playing tic-tac-toe, and we're using some stars from our galaxy as we play our competition. We're going to have the yellow stars for the girls team with Yuna being our scorekeeper, placing those stars, hopefully in three in a row, to earn a point for the girls team. And then Deb is coming using the orange stars for the boys team to see how many they can get correct as well. First two, you may step to the middle. Let's review chapters 33 through 35 for our test in our next lesson. What do we call a person who changes something for the better? Students watching? It is a reformer. No points here next to. What was the plan to control businesses, packaging food, and conserving landmarks? Square deal. Yes. Girls have it next to. Who was the youngest man to become president? Theodore Roosevelt. Girls next to. What president asked Roosevelt to be his vice president? McKinley. Tybo teams a point. What do we call a group of volunteers led by Roosevelt who fought the Spanish-American War in Cuba? Rough Riders. Cuba. No points. Wait for me to finish. Tell me the battle which made Rough Riders famous and helped end the war. Sing on Hill. Tie. New question so we can break our tie. What became a national monument due to the square deal? Grand Canyon. Girls get to place their star next. Next to you. Who are the group of men and women who take care of par parks and forests? Grand Tracers. Tie. Let's do a new question. Roosevelt was the first American to win what? Nobel Peace Prize. Boys wear hair faster. Boys place your star next to you. After college, Roosevelt decided to go into what? Politics. Boys next to you. What state did Roosevelt run for governor in? New York. Yes, boys next to. What country did Roosevelt build a canal in? Panama. Boys next to. Tell me an ocean that the Panama Canal connects. Atlantic. Yes, Atlantic. Boys had it out first. Boys get a star for that one. The other was Pacific. Roosevelt led a group of men called the what? Rough Riders. Tiny new question. What was Theodore Roosevelt's nickname? Teddy. Girls, next two. Roosevelt's face is one of the presidents carved into what? Mount Rushmore. Ty, new question. What toy was named after Theodore Roosevelt? Teddy bear. Ty, new question. Let's break our tie. Tell me what we call the home where orphans live. Orphan. Orphan. Boys wear hair faster. Boys get that point. Tell me what we call a preacher of the Bible who emphasizes salvation. Students watching? It is an evangelist. No points here next to. Who was the famous baseball player who became an evangelist? Billy Sunday. Tie. Let's break our tie. During which war was Billy Sunday born? Civil War. Tie. New question. Where did he Billy hear about the Bible? Orphanage. Girls. Next to. Why were Billy and his brother sent to an orphanage? Because the president didn't take care of them. Died yes. So cool. Their mom couldn't care for them. Girls had it out first. A point for the girls' team. Tell me which professional baseball team Billy Sunday first played for. White Stockings. Girls have it next to. Where did Billy Sunday work after he stopped playing baseball? YMCA. Girls have that one next to. Tell me the name of the buildings built for Billy Sunday's meetings. Tabernacle. Boys next to. What did Billy Sunday organize so mothers could come to the services? Yes, Girls had it out first next to. What were many of Billy Sunday's sermons aimed against? Alcohol. Yes, girls have it next to. What sport did Billy Sunday play before becoming an evangelist? Baseball. Tie new questions. Uh, what would people do after Billy Sunday left a town? Students watching? They would hold Bible studies. No points here. Pause. Let's take a look at our score. So it looks like the girls have three and the boys have one. So girls are in the lead right now. Next two may step to the middle. We're going on to chapter 35 with Laura Ingalls Wilder. Tell me what we call a covered wagon used by pioneers traveling west. Prairie scooter. Boys. Next two. What was the troubled time in the 1930s when many people were out of work and hungry? Yes, I will give it to you because of the word depression. It's also called the Great Depression. Boys have that one next, too. The author of the Little House books is? Laura Ingalls Wilder. Girls wear hair faster. Girls get that one next, too. What sickness caused Mary's blindness? Scott Girls wear hair faster next, too. What did Laura promise to be for Mary? Her eyes. Ty, new question. Stay. What job did Laura get when she was 15? Teacher. Girls have it next, too. Who did Laura marry? Students watching? 
He was Almanza Wilder. No points here. Next two. Tell me one state Laura lived in as a little girl. Wisconsin. Boys. Next two. The other was Minnesota. Who helped Laura edit her books? Her daughter. Yes, right. Gage. Boys have that point. Her name was Rose. Why did Laura write her autobiographies? So people wouldn't forget what, what Pioneer's Days were. Yes, exactly right. Good, Anna. Next two. Tell me the name of Laura's first book. Little House in the Big Woods. Yes, boys have it good, Josh. How many books did she write in all? Five. Five. Students watching? Eight. No points here. And we'll pause for just a moment. Let's take a look at our score. Girls are in the lead with four, and then boys had one. So we're going to continue, but we're going to go on this time to reviewing our states in the same way with our tic-tac-toe game. So we'll see who is able to win with our state review. Emily, slip to the side for us. Turn off the lights. Students watching, see if you can continue to beat these contestants, and I'll ask you your score as well at the end. So on to our states again, and see how quickly you can remember them. So facing our states, give me our first two, and we are ready. Washington. Girls get to place their star next. Next two. Alaska. Alaska. Tie new question. Stay so we can break our tie. Hawaii. Hawaii. Girls get that one next to. Oregon. Boys next to. California. Girls get to place that star next. Nevada. Boys next to. Idaho. Boys next to. Fantana. You're very close. Students watching, Montana. No points. Next two. Wyoming. Wyoming. Girls have it next two. Students watching, it is Utah. No points here. Next two. Wyoming. Wyoming. Boys. Next two. Arizona. Boys were a hair faster next to. New Mexico. Boys next to. Colorado. Boys next to. North Dakota. North Dakota. Boys were a hair faster next to. Nebraska. Boys next to. Kansas. Boys next to. Boys next to. Texas, Texas. Boys next to. Oklahoma. No. Students watching? California. New Mexico. No points here. Next to. Colorado. Boys next to. Kansas. Nebraska. Nebraska girls have it next to. Kansas. Boys next to. Minnesota. Minnesota. Girls have it. Minnesota next to. Iowa. Iowa girls next to. Missouri. Missouri boys next to. Arkansas. Yes, next to. Madison. Louisiana. Boys next to. Wisconsin. Girls next to. Students watching, it is Illinois. No points here next to. Tell me the baseball player from this state. I'm Billy Sunday. Billy, Sunday. Billy, Billy Sunday. Sunday. Stay for another question. You are right. Indiana. Indiana girls have it next to. Michigan. Tie both teams a point. Or let's stay and break our tie so we can know who places their star. Ohio. Boys next to. Kentucky. Tie, stay. Tennessee. Boys next to. Mississippi. Boys next to. Alabama. Boys next to. Girls, you can do it. Georgia. Boys next to. South Carolina. Yes. Bo uh, boys have that one next to. North Carolina. North Carolina. Boys next to. 
Virginia. Tie. Let's stay and break our tie. West Virginia. Boys, next two. Indian. Ohio. Ohio, no points. Next two. Pennsylvania. Girls wear a hair faster. Next two. New York. Tie. Vermont. Girls wear a hair faster. Next two. Green one. New Hampshire. Boys, next two. Tie. Stay. Let's break our tie. The blue one. Massachusetts. Girls. Next two. Purple. Connecticut. Yes. Boys. Next two. Pink one. Or red. Rhode Island. Rhode Island. Boys have it next to The pinkish red one. Delaware. Boys. Next two.